And as you so see, I brought my poems in plastic in a plastic bag. Um, and um, uh, one reporter asked me which ones did I choose. So this is the, the explanation I just wrote. Poems in a plastic bag. Which ones should I read in front of the Burmese embassy? Sorry, but I will not even say Burma slash Myanmar, because lots of people say it with a slash at the conferences I go to. I can read poetry about people who are already dead. They can't be hurt anymore. Their remains have already been moved from Jando, Canefield Cemetery, to the tight regimented rows of Yue, far from water, baking in the sun. I can read about dust. I can read about chilies. I can read about love and geese, death and blue hydrangeas. I must remember to take a big black plastic trash bag to hold my poems so they don't get wet when it rains. I owe as much to the over 2,000 political prisoners, including 150 women, the bloggers, the poets, the citizen journalists, the comedian Zagana, still in prison in Burma.